House of Water, Republican, in all seasons, peace. On the bruised world of Umrah, the House of Water maintains its representative democracy. One of two notable Republican outliers in the Baronies, Umrah prides itself as a world of free people. On Umrah, the saying goes, the only person above you is your neighbor. Umrah started out as a backwater farming world under the Anorum Pasicalia, drifting under the radar of the various mythic figures burning across the stars between Karakis, Kairadan, and other more important worlds, little is known of the early status, politics, and history of Umrah, other than that it too split from the Anno Pasicalia prior to the succession war and resisted Tyrannus's initial advances. Records of the following annexation war on Umrah detail Tajid's bombardment of the planet and the punishing nuclear scouring of its gentle grasslands and low-lying cities that eventually lead to the world's surrender. The House of Water was established during the dynastic late and given Umrah to reconstruct a manageable state from the limping nuclear ruin, supported by the early New Federation and subsequent federal Karakan monarchy, the House of Water implemented dramatic social reforms beneficial to the noble and ignoble classes both. Realizing early on that universal social assistance and mobility was necessary if the world was to be reconstituted from its stagnant state, the people of Umrah abolished the legal divisions of noble and ignoble altogether, creating the first representative democracy in the Baronies. With its constitutional form of self-determined rule, Umrah became an oddity among the worlds of the concern, a world without nobility. Despite this break with tradition, Umrah was never considered a threat to the other major houses until the revolution on Free Sanjak and the material scandal, during which House of Sand intelligence operatives discovered that water was providing material aid to the ungratefuls. Following intense diplomatic wrangling and a series of minor crises, Umrah reaffirmed its commitment to Republican ideals, today, it has come to enjoy core status in union and leads the coalition of Republicans in the federal Karakan monarchy. The population of Umrah is an impressive 15 billion free persons, of which none are noble or ignoble, with class division solely in economic nature, even then, Umrah's population enjoys a relatively equal standard of living compared to the other worlds of the concern. The House of Water continues to use baronic terminology, though with differing definitions, Major House, when referring to the House of Water, is synonymous with the republican idea of a nation-state, i.e., a government organized and empowered by an elected governing body to self-administer affairs of the nation, rather than a political entity attuned to the will of a single monarch. And Minor House is simply the designation given to an administrative district, rather than a dynastic, landed, or propertied family. Along with the House of Dust, the House of Water elects and sends its representative to the Baronic Council, drawing from a pool of candidates that pass an initial primary process. The House of Water's constitution divides Umrah into 80 arrondissements, administrative districts managed by elected representatives, with populations numbering around 180 to 190 million persons, from which elected representatives are sent to the ignoble house. Aside from its strong reformist streak, water is also notable for its commitment to projects of ecological conservation, reconstruction, and biological preservation. Umrah is unusual in that the majority of its cities and urban centers are on reclaimed or raised land over its oceans, with aquaculture providing most of its food and major resources for export, this interest has extended in recent years to xenobiology and frontier exploration, and many Umarans are committed to Union scientific or survey expeditions. Large portions of Umarat are still uninhabitable due to the presence of toxic compounds from the weapons unleashed during the Old War, and the presence of these compounds has had varied effects on growth and mutation of the local plant and wildlife, this has created large zones in which human habitation is impossible but the wilderness has flourished, in sometimes unpredictable ways. As a constituent state of the federal Karakan monarchy, the House of Water maintains a house company, though without the filial and dynastic implications of other major houses house companies, its representative on the Baronic Council is from House Umarit, the capital administrative district of Umarat, and its banner company is the First Oceanic, also from House Umarit. House of Moments, Federalist, in blood, gold. Deep in the canyons of Begum, the House of Moments pushes the human form from beyond its limits. On its rhyme surface and deep within its humid cathedral canyons, the people of the House of Moments have built for themselves a livable home from harsh rock. Begum is known throughout the Baronies as the ugliest world in the concern, a small ball of bitterly cold tundra wrinkled and cracked by mountains and kilometers deep canyons, there is indeed a little beauty to be seen, but of the harshest and most austere kind, the world, as with its people, takes getting to know, Begum's beauty is hidden precisely because of its severity, and the seriousness with which its people go about their work. Founded as a monastery world by the Xenoglossians and later open to non-order colonization, Begum declared, 
in its own private way, independence from the Anno during its long, slow, downfall. Begum wisely submitted before even Tyrannus returned to Karakis, and compared to worlds like Karakis, Ispasalar, and Kyradin, Begum made it through the fighting largely undamaged, it was one of the few worlds that supplied Tyran's armies with soldiers and armor to aid his consolidation campaign across Karakis, Kyradin, and the other worlds of the concern. One of Begum's legendary figures from this time, the Bright Star, originally under Baron Mulanno, who went on to become a general in Tyran's armies before dying during the assault on the Anorum throne, persists in facsimile form to this day as the standard template for all pilots in the Endless Company. As valuable as they were, arms and armor were far from the most significant additions Begum made to Tyran's war effort, it was the world's advanced medical and rapid facsimile programs that proved to be the most important contributions. Miniaturized to fit aboard Tajid's battleships and automated to produce rapid fax in transit, Begum's people makers proved indispensable for supplementing Tajid's ground forces, after the war, demand for soldiers gave way, replaced with demand for ready labor and domestic police forces, Begum was uniquely positioned to distribute, manage, and maintain the technology that could produce orders of rapid fax to fill gaps in local recruitment. From this, the houses of Begum, who would go on to become the minor houses of the House of Moments, built the foundations of the vast wealth and influence they hold in the modern day. The House of Moments is the only major house that continues to work as one planet towards a single goal, the production and perfection of the human form, the processes of its replication, and the broadening of its possibilities. Moments works closely with Smith Shimano Core Pro, perfecting cloning processes for one-to-one -one facsimile orders and user-specified biocompatible technologies as well as luxury, lifestyle, industrial, military, and other blue-sky augmentations. Moments provides to the baronies, per capita, the most medical doctors, technicians, and bio-slash-pharma personnel of any world in the concern. Thanks to a healthy virtual and physical exchange program with SSC's Const Ella Congress, Moments is a surprisingly cosmopolitan house, with an outsized expat population in Const Ella space. Begum is home to the Xenoglossary, the main monastery of the Order Xenoglossia, the precognitive augurs and warrior monks that maintain a separate but parallel society to the core baronic houses, the relationship between the house and the monastery is surprisingly threadbare and at times frosty. The House of Moments is a federalist house with a population around 15 billion souls, only 1% of whom are of the noble class. Its banner company is House Mulan's Endless Company, other notable minor houses include House Maroyer, House Kothreftes, and House Milos. Hello there, if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell button. If you really want to support my channel, you could visit my Patreon page, or buy me some coffee. links in the description. Anyway, have a nice day.